In the following videos of this section, we will be going and creating code based on the fundamentals that we previously talked about in the previous videos. So for me, it is crucially important to talk about the best practices I personally use to set up my production-ready environment. So the first thing that you can see on my screen is that I will be using the Visual Studio Code IDE, and I won't be using Jupyter Notebooks because I believe that anything that has to be production ready has to be done onto a proper and professional IDE to be able to test, debug, and integrate everything on that production final implementation that you make. The second point is that I will be using the Conda package management system and environment management system, which you can see down below here, okay? And I personally believe also that Conda is much more suitable than virtual M for any data science related project. And finally, the last point I want to note is that my uh, OS will be Linux based. It will be Ubuntu 18.04 in this case. And I believe also that Ubuntu and Linux is much more suitable for anything done from a programming perspective or for something that has to be run onto production, primarily because it's open source, its security is very high, it's free to use, you have a much more better community support, you have much more reliability than in this case Windows, and all cloud providers uh, have it in terms of creating your virtual servers. This doesn't mean that you cannot use other tools, but this is uh, what I personally use and, and why uh, uh, and what I will be working on so that you have all the information transparently and that you can yourselves build yours using the same tools or others. So stay tuned for the following videos in which we will be explaining the framework in terms of code and classes that we will be using onto the following uh, code practices and research.